So what David Getter did was he went on two AI websites yeah. and then he basically, so he's got this, let's call it a dub plate where he, he can play in a rave or in a festival where he's got Eminem rapping off what he put into the original AI. Do you know what I mean? So, so and it what, sounds just say, like Eminem. Now, he, I think he typed the lyrics, yeah. but then it did it in the style of Eminem. Eminem doesn't do nothing. Doesn't do nothing. He's had nothing to do with the no, process. Just, Write me the lyrics of a song that include the melody la 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 la. Mm. And it, it did. Couldn't believe it. Remember, we're not uh, experts in music and AI. We are experts in music, but not <laughs> that AI side of it. And they sit on that piano, if whether it's jazz music, and they create this melody through their feelings, through their soul. How the hell you can't can a machine can't ever compete that. with that? Yo, what's happening, people? Welcome back to the S A S A S podcast. What is it? Life, love, and laughter. I don't know if I chucked in love there, didn't I? Yeah, the it is all love. It is all love. Uh, <laughs> It's life and laughter. Life and laughter. That's how we do it. Sponsored by Just Juice. (laughs) Shout out to the gang. I actually said to Shot, I goes, every time we do an episode, there's always a Just Juice there. And he went, yeah, we're looking for that sponsorship. (laughs) Yeah, we're looking for that sponsorship. A couple of Magnums on the table next time as well. You know what I mean? Shout out to the Maggie gang. But yeah, we are back. Make sure you like, subscribe, leave your comments, all of that stuff. Let us know what you listen on as well, man. Because a lot of people I know, they listen on the podcast app. A lot of people listen on Spotify. Me personally, I actually do both, man. I listen to the Spotify while when I'm out on road and then when I'm in my yard. Artists kind of watch on the YouTube, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, big up everyone locking on, locking in. What are we saying today, man? Um, I think we are. We actually asked some people what they wanted to uh, right. see or what they wanted to talk about. Um, somebody uh, mentioned something about AI and how it's affecting music. Yeah. yeah. So I think that'd be a good one. Um, remember, we're not uh, experts in music and AI. We are experts in music, <laughs> but not that AI side of it. Yeah. But, it's it's uh, kind of a, a new thing for everyone, isn't it? Like when you hear about NFT, yeah. you have your initial sort of perspective on it, how it's going to affect you, how you can maybe use it to your advantage. Yeah. I guess AI is the same thing, man. Do you know what I'm saying? It's like, you know, it's, it's going to become a spicy subject throughout the year, I think, because I think we started off talking about it before we even started talking yeah. about what David Getter did the other day. Yeah, tell us about that because um, you, I just you just literally told me before we started recording what what's this, what happened there. Well, basically, from my perspective, he created his own Eminem dub plate without hollering Eminem. Can I just say there's an uh, SSS Eminem dub plate coming? But honestly, M actually <laughs> M actually filmed it. He recorded it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah so what David Getter did was he went on two AI websites this is what I remember from the video and he he, he, had, he, had, he wrote the lyrics that he wanted Eminem to say and it was something about the rave and rave culture because obviously he's a big dance DJ isn't it? do you know what I'm saying so he did that and he went to another AI website and, and found Eminem's voice, voice yeah. and then he basically so he's got this let's call it a dub plate where he, that he can play in a rave or in a festival where he's got Eminem the voice of Eminem, it sounds exactly like Marshall Mathers, you know what wow. I mean? Basically rapping off what he put into the original AI, do you know what I mean? So, so and it what, sounds just say, like Eminem. What did he, he went to, he put, when he, the first AI he went in, did he just typed the lyrics or did he ask the AI to write the lyrics for him? Now he, I think he typed the lyrics, yeah. but then it did it in the style of Eminem. Oh wow. Do you know what I mean? Because you yeah. know Eminem raps a certain yeah. way. So what so, did he charge for that? Eminem. Well, nah, this is the this is the thing. This is what he said on the thing. He goes, I could never release this because yeah. I'm getting into all sorts of issues, but I can go and play it in wow. in the spot, which opens up a lot of controversy and a lot yeah. of debates because Eminem might not want that his voice yeah. in that lyric. You know well, what I mean? Imagine if someone's getting Eminem to talk about something that he doesn't believe in. Yeah. yeah. Do you know what I mean? And that could, then what it is, is the way people consume things is, oh, did you hear what M said? Oh, yeah. But he didn't actually say it. How does it, it work, though? Does he lay... Does it just copy him or does he lay the vocals down? No, he doesn't. Eminem doesn't do nothing. He doesn't do nothing. He's had nothing to do with the no, process. That's the, there's no permission, voice. nothing. No. The AI can yeah. can emulate his voice. Yeah, wow. I've seen it with someone else. I can't think of who it was, but um, so I am aware slightly. I've been really interested in this whole AI thing. Um, you know, I've been putting people onto the art side of it. Yeah. I mean, um, we've, we've got a release, uh, United We Stand, and uh, that that artwork was actually done by a, a Mid Journey on the AI. So I've been on that, and yeah. everyone I've been telling about it, they've been getting back to me, going, "Oh my god, this is sick!" And yeah. you know, I just think the thing is, is you have to embrace it. There's no point in like yeah. shunning it. You've you know, you've got to kind of go, "Well, it's, it's here. Look, mm. what can we do?" But um, you know, the Eminem thing, like, wow, that's mad. But yeah. uh, can you imagine? Look, we, you know, we have this time now where it's just pure bootlegs that are about. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Can you imagine <laughs> the amount of specials that are going to be coming? Well, out? Man, 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 man could get like, let's say, Flo Dan's got a big tune yeah. out. 
Um, let's just say like now they could say, well, we don't need to go flow Dan and give him like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Five grand to do yeah. the dub. Now we can just make our own flow yeah. Dan dub. So it's kind of, this is what you get to. You get to the dangers yeah. of it. This is, it's eliminating yeah. the human aspect. Yeah. But yeah. I was saying this, I mean, I've Fresh put up a post about it say saying about he Fresh. was concerned yeah. and Benny L put up a post saying how concerned it is and worrying it is. But what I said, to, I think I said it to both of them, like, the AI can't create the new thing. Yeah. It can only emulate What's successful formulas. Yeah. So it'll be like, yeah, that Beatles hit back in blah, blah. Yeah. I'm just going to copy that because that struck a chord with people. But people didn't just like the Beatles because the song. Yeah. They liked them because their image, what yeah, they represent, the, whole thing the story. They, yeah. It's like yeah. 50 Cent. You can't, you can't, AI can't emulate getting shot nine times and having that story on his first yeah. album. Yeah. Yeah. And people relate to the story and what the, the identity of the artist, not just a song. A song is like yeah. almost the least important yeah. thing. Yeah. Well, it's a fact though, isn't it? Like, AI um, it, it's, it's cutting people's jobs like yeah. well, you know what I'm saying that's, Toby a, that's said a big that thing so it's like basically all the big companies are investing in it um, and the the smaller scale like they they basically you know a lot of people are losing their jobs over mm. it you know what I mean it's just it's a fact of the world yeah. the robots and whatever are just replacing people you see it in the supermarkets obviously Click, well, click. Well, I thought, yeah. you know what? I said what this years ago. I remember once, um, you know, when you go into a supermarket now, you actually put your club card in and you walk around with your scanner. And I remember just one day when I first did it, I went, I'm actually technically working for Tesco's now. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Un unpaid because I'm there. Bleep, bleep, bleep. And then you go in, yeah. bleep it. And basically it's, it's a, it's a, drama it's a one get, in yeah. 10, one in 10 chance you're going to get stopped mm. to, to check your basket. Yeah. Mm. Do you know what I mean? And um, That's people's jobs just gone, you yeah. know what I mean? And people that are used to doing that now to, go, to try and go in a supermarket and get someone's attention and like say, I need something from behind the counter. It's like a long thing. Oi, you know what I mean? That is so mad you say yeah. that, right? My dad called me about two weeks ago and he was like, um, he's like, can you can you do me a favour? Can you go online and order me a fridge? And I was like, all right, cool. And he went, mm. and he was kicking off. He's like, I can't believe I've been into Curry's. I walked around and I said, I want that one. Yeah. And uh, the guy went, yep, no problem, sir. Um, you know, log online. And he went, I've got the van outside. He wants it now. <laughs> yeah, can yeah, I have yeah, it? Yeah, and they yeah. went, no, it don't work like that. And he went, what's the point of having the store? Yeah. yeah. What was the point of having well, the store? Do that's you know the future I mean? we're it's probably just, gonna be living in, isn't it? I mean the store is almost advertising yeah. now. Yeah. yeah. You know, that's just free well not free advertising, they obviously pay their yeah. rates to have, have it there, but it's almost mm. advertisement. It's somewhere you can go and walk in. And it's also probably a period where people they know people still are going into yeah. shops for yeah. now. Yeah. yeah. And that's what they're used to. Yeah. You can't get all the people that do go to the shops and do go yeah. to the town centre to suddenly go online. Because there's yeah. loads of there's loads of the older generation mm. that ain't trying to do that. They nah. they they fear the whole thing with yeah. putting their card details well, in and all yeah. that. So funny you I'm say old the card. Like that, yeah. Well, the thing is, is like my dad was like, oh, I can't even pay cash. He wanted to pay. It was like 150 quid fridge. It wasn't even a, yeah. a bad boy fridge. It was just yeah, some basic yeah. fridge. And like, it, it was like, you know, I'll give you the, I'll give you the money. Can you do it? And I was like, yeah, cool. But, the thing is, is it's like, I'll have to order it on card. My dad don't even know how to send a text. Yeah, And, and they that. expect him to go and do it on a card. Do well, there, it doesn't yeah. make sense. Well, there are certain movements to say that we are moving towards a cashless society. Yeah, we've got to stop yeah. that, man. That, you know that I mean? definitely can't happen. And it's, it is mad because, I, you know, I, my daughter done a little uh, bit of work, you know, a little sort, sort of to give her pocket money kind of thing. You know, mm. like you try to, don't just give her money, give them an incentive. Okay, yeah. tidy up this and I'll give you a five yeah. or a tenner or whatever. Yeah. Inflation these days. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, honestly, I used to get a pound, yeah. Like they're like, what? I said, I'll give you a five, and they're like, five. Yeah, no, nah, Dad, I'm yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, nothing. Nah. Yeah, yeah. Like 50 you know what I mean? Yeah. She's like, Cost I can't living, get, man. She goes, I can't get fags with that. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. My daughter doesn't smoke. She's only yeah. eighteen. But anyway, <laughs> uh, the thing is, is what I'm trying to say is like, I said to her, babe, you don't understand like the importance of cash, and she's mm. like, nah, Dad. She's anyway. So I give her, I think I give her a tenner and do you know Actual what? cash, yeah. I give her a ten pound cash right. and she's like, she come back to me about three weeks later going, Dad, can, can I give you this back? Can you just transfer it to my account? <laughs> because also there's that thing where yeah. the kids don't want to walk around with a tenner cash on them. Yeah. You know, yeah. they'd rather have their card. Everything's online anyway, innit? Well, and then you've got Apple Pay now, so you yeah. don't even have to have the card. To, yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, I'm, I'm, I, who's on Apple Pay in this Well, room? I mean, yeah. no, I'm not going to lie, yeah. I'm not. <laughs> see, I'm, I'm not. I'm no, not you know what it is? Card. I I used to have an Oyster card to get here. Right. Right. And then now I just get my phone and go, do yeah, it, it does it make it. I've got one account on there and I just basically have it on my phone. And sometimes I do forget my wallet or I haven't got my wallet. Yeah. I'm like, shit. And then it's so much easier, man. Just, yeah. just, just tap just on your yeah. phone. Yeah. Yeah. You've got everything there. But as far as AI, AI like. Yeah, sorry. We, we probably went <laughs> <put it> off. <laughs> no, Thank well, you for bringing it back. No, well, yeah. I'm, I'm old school as well. So, like, I don't go, I don't shop online. 
Do you understand? I like really? going, I like even going, food shopping. Yeah, I like, yeah, well, food shop we do online. Yeah, yeah. I get that delivered myself. Mrs. Does it or whatever. But when it comes to clothes and shit like that, yeah. I like to see. Oh, the no, item. I think there is certain do things. You know yeah, I, mean? yeah. I hear what you're saying. I think with that, you need to go in and but like put it on, and feel it. Feel it and yeah, 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 the other yeah. way, she won't go into the shop. She's like, every time I go to the shop or I go here, it's just like a long queue, yeah. two hours, and then she gets all this stuff sent, and it just keeps coming, and then she don't like none of it don't fit, and then she will just take it back to the post office or whatever. Do you know what? Yeah, that that that, that generation yeah. slightly younger than. Us, that's what they do and they're yeah, used yeah, to it yeah. do you know what I'm saying whereas I'm me I want to go yeah. try it on because yeah. I know a small in yeah. say Moschino is going to be different to Versace or this sort of shit well, listen, way, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I actually I actually know of an artist that used to buy stuff mm. right online take a photo of it and send it back the next day yeah, oh, right. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. wow. yeah. they're looking fresh in the gums yeah. But yeah yeah well that's like when people do music videos isn't it and you see him like right that jacket cost seven grand man but yeah, they, yeah. That, that was the stylist who bought that you gotta put that back on the rack you ain't walking out to shoot with that man, you know what I mean? Wow. That's a good one. Still can go to the shop and do a photo shoot. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I mean, and start putting on the garments. Hey, do you know what yeah. we should do? Next photo shoot, just order bare <laughs> stuff, and then what yeah. it is, get it in, wear it all, and then just send it back. Send it back. Right, so we're not that, trying to. We're not trying. To, so we're not giving no ideas. That's what they it. do with stylists, man. But I think on the AI side of things, man, I think what it is, I think if you're a consumer, I think you see these AI things that like, oh, you can do art, or you could like, you know, you even mentioned it to me before. What is it? What's the app you're using for certain things? Uh, Chat G. GPT. Yeah, so you can you can ask it a question, it will come back yeah. to you with a load of ideas well, and whatnot. There's so. a new one, mm. right? Um, actually, someone put me onto it yesterday, right? And um, Bing are doing a thing called. Uh, it's actually like a like because you know Chat GPT. That's only, the one you told me about. Yeah, yeah, that's the one I've been using. That only goes up to 2021. So okay. the data, but it does learn. I, I know I've mentioned this before before, but it does learn. So if you if I asked it, tell me about Harry Shotter, and it said uh, Harry was born in Wisconsin in the USA, mm. I could say no. Was and he was born in Kent. And it updates. So it's and like what a Wikipedia. Is, that's what yeah, you do with that, then, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, that's yeah what, and then yeah. what it is, the next time you ask it, it'll go, Harry Shot was born in Kent. Right. It's mad. It is, yeah, it but, does but, but, but yeah, 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 yeah. Let me jump on that, though. Because you could put in false information. Yeah. yeah, there is. Yes, there is that as well. Yeah. Definitely. Surely it would have some sort of background check, maybe. No? Um, well, who's going to check it? The robot. Yeah, I yeah, mean, it's pretty crazy. It's it, that's, that's, it where it gets, fact, that's where it yeah. gets a little bit yeah, techy. But, but then again, Wikipedia is like that as well. It Do you is. know the maddest thing about yeah. Wikipedia? You're not allowed. So I see something on Wikipedia and it was false. So I went in there to say, and what I actually typed was, no, what it is, is I never did this. I did this. Or, mm. or no, I was the person that made this song or whatever. Yeah, and yeah. it come back, some moderator somewhere, knobhead, um, <laughs> he turned around and he went, um, he turned around and he went, um, we've took your thing off because you can't talk about yourself and I was like but I'm I replied going but I'm the person that knows about myself and he went yeah. it's not how it works I yeah. just thought God you know I ain't yeah. got nothing else better to do so but, some forced, forced but shit going it's called I, I, Bing look Bing.com oh, okay. right so basically it was released yesterday yeah. um, so we're recording on uh, what's the date now is it the 8th, 8th yeah, of, something like that. so yeah, on yeah. the 7th of February it was released and it's a brand new thing and what it is is the, the bit of the, the chat GPT where it can only go to 2021, this actually will search the internet. And I see some um, stuff that it done. It was like one question was asked. I mean, just the most random question. I suppose it's a good way of testing it was, um, I've got a, a, a 69 Chevy and I want to fit a sofa in it. You know, what are the dimensions? Mm. And it went, blah, 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 and it just, mate, it, yeah, it answered yeah. everything. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It was like mad. Yeah, so let me ask you this though. As someone who makes music, would you use AI to make music? Um, no, but... But I will tell you this, I did something the other day with the chat GPT and I, I put, um, write me the lyrics of a song that include the melody, la, 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 la. Mm. And it, it did. Couldn't believe it. It wrote a whole song. Now, some of it was a bit like, la, 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 I was walking down the road, skipping it. Like, you know, you're not yeah. going to use them, but... Mm. Some of it was like, oh, that's all right. And mm. you know what I mean? And I actually believe that um, people are going to start using that for inspiration because, you know, look. Don't you think that's creatives... dumbing down your mind? Yeah, that's what I Do you know what? It's funny because I was saying, look, you actually see, I said, don't you? I said this in the conversation with one of my mates. Uh, there was a group here. Mm. And I said, you, my worry is, is um, it's going to, you know, the, the students coming through is going to dumb them down. I know somebody that had a, a, they call it a dissertation where you've got to send something into uni. Okay, yeah. yeah and he'd yeah. done a, he done a, he just, tested it on he didn't um, put it forward but mm. he tested it on uh, the chat GPT and it actually wrote a better one than what he wrote mm. okay and uh, he actually checked it there's a plagiarism tool you can sorry you can check it for plagiarism to see um, 
Right. You know, because if you copy something off of Google, there's yeah. ways to check that. Because that's what certain utes were doing, isn't it? They was copy and pasting stuff off. Yeah, yeah. Off and websites. So, so what for it their is is uh, essays the, and whatnot. The schools can the schools can find out now, but apparently I found out yesterday that the schools now have an anti. Uh, AI thing that can actually detect de yes yes detect so, when it's been written in yeah, AI yeah wow is that so, software yeah software yeah. so right, okay. mate this is like because the yeah, thing is, is it just it'll just speed things up but also it takes the element out of the work side yeah. of things and it makes things easier but, I suppose but we're but. in a time where you know we've talked about this before where everyone just go, oh yeah look look three seconds mm. and they move on they mm. move on mm. and you know time is of importance I mean I I, I, I was gonna tweet yes I didn't tweet because I was busy <laughs> but I was gonna tweet mm. bloody hell where's the Day gone, mm. you know like I, I'm up at like 8 o'clock in the morning and like next thing you know I'm sitting there it's like half 10 at night and I'm like yeah. Don't you think, though, the best music ever, for, I'm going to take an example, the best music that's ever been made is when someone, let's say someone's in love, yeah, they're in like the best relationship they've ever been in, they go to the studio, they're a piano player, they get do whatever they need to do to get into a zone, bun a spliff, whatever, and then they sit on that piano, if whether it's jazz music, and they create this melody through their feelings, through their soul. How the hell you can't can a machine can't ever compete that. with that? Yeah, and those but, who are using it, mm. to me, are not real musicians. Yeah, no, I hear what you're saying. Mm. They're lazy. It is lazy, but I just think we're in a time. Of, it doesn't matter what time we're in. We're, we're in a time you, of laziness. Yeah, but you don't. You don't just because Takes everyone just just because everyone yeah. else is lazy. You don't yeah. have to be. No, I know that. I mean, the thing is, is it's a difficult one because you know, like it, for example, I've got like 20 projects sitting there unfinished. You know, I, I need to. You know, I've got to do this, that, and the other. And it, it, you know, when you're sitting down and you, you, you get in the studio, next thing the phone rings, and you've for half an hour you turn it off yeah true. Give me that website, space. Give me that that website anyway I want to um, get it to write some bars for me <laughs> <laughs> I'll program it for next week well yeah. listen when this new one comes, wait, yeah. the, the actual website <laughs> <laughs> I'm like yeah copy all that no shit but the me. thing is you know you could actually put yeah. you could actually test it right honestly when you get home yeah. test it right do something like say um, uh, write me a, a 32 bar lyric yeah. about um, you know uh, Arsenal say, winning the league yeah uh -huh. whatever something mm. like that and you'll be surprised now, some of it will be a yeah. bit like yeah I can't use that but other bits yeah. of it you'll be like okay that's cool even if you don't take the words for word yeah. you just take the inspiration out of it I'm not yeah. telling you to do it but that's no, what okay. it is I okay. just think this is the first stage of us handing over everything we are to machines man yeah yeah mm -hmm. and, okay. and we, we have, we've we've survived this long with we, as civilization without giving that all this control our minds and it is, minds have shaped the world Mm. You know, what people's thoughts and what, how they feel about stuff has changed the world and resonated. You know, music has changed the world, bro. Yeah. If everyone starts using this stuff, everything's going to sound the same. Yeah. yeah. Why would it be but different? Do you not, like, I mean, I see a thing Ed Sheeran done the other day, uh, like Big Up Eddie, also done an amazing thing for Jamal. Uh, yeah, I heard about like, it. That still. was amazing. But um, he did a thing the other day. I see it, it was like um, a little TikTok reel or something yeah. like that. And um, he went, pl I'll play any song with the same four chords. Mm. And then the, they, the it was like Jimmy Fallon or something from America was going yeah. there. You know, uh, let it be. And he went, let it be. Let it, and it was like, okay. And then he went, mm. get, he gave him a load of songs. And every single song was the same four chords. So yeah. would you say that it, the most successful songs in music of all time mm. are all the same four chords? This just played in different ways. And do you know what I mean? But they, that is actually a thing. Do you know what I mean? Like some of the most successful songs in the world are all the same. Chords. Oh, because people always say, well, yeah, producers will say, I'll, I'll go up there if I want to make a happy tune. Yeah. I go down there yeah. if I want to make something. Yeah. Like, they, they, there is certain so sort there, of sciences to it. Exactly. So yeah. the thing is, is this has been going on like for years and mm. it's just like. It's you called know, formula, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. My, my first um, uh, experience of knowing that AI is real and. You know, this this new technology was when I was getting a rental car and I got a zip car mm. and I had the uh I had the the app on my phone and basically you book you book it online, you upload your license online and do all yeah. these things and then it gives you it gives you an app and then you're like, Okay, I need to get a car. So you just go on the app and it's you got all these cars everywhere around. Yeah. And you just go up to the car with your phone, pull it to the to the window, wow. opens the car, mm. then the keys are in the ignition. Wow. You drive it. Basically, you can rent it for two, three hours, yeah. how long you need it, mm -hmm. and then you put it back in that spot or whatever when you need it. But you can, you can, can you put it in any spot, or well, do you have to be in the same spot? There's driving bays all yeah, over, yeah, but you yeah. have to put it back in the same If you yeah. put it in a different spot, it's a £5 extra charge, oh, but okay. they okay. do something. It's, you don't even need a key, so basically, just go up to the Crazy. window. Just go like, it just yeah. it opens a car, 
and then you get in the car and then you can rent it for like four hours, three hours. If you need it for more, you can get it for the day. Yeah. And then you just take it back and you're just like, raw, and you drop it back and then they put the keys in the glovey and just lock it again with your yeah. phone. And I'm like, yeah. See stuff, see stuff Crazy. like that. I like. Yeah. Because it's it's Futuristic, providing a service yeah. and it's enhancing. Yeah. And it's, it's not it's not a dumbing down thing. It's a speeding up thing and it's yeah. it's, it's a service. Yeah. I, so people might think I'm more anti tech. It's not that. Yeah. It's not that. It's just it's just I don't want us to lose the important side of what we do, especially yeah. as artists and creatives. You're taking and, the art, you, you, you're saying, you don't want it, to, it's taking out the art, basically, yeah. of what you got to do. And what makes it special, yeah. man, do you know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm, take, take the musician side out of it, like an artist, mm. someone who like, who, who paints, do you know what I mean? Mm. And then and, and now they're just going to study whatever Van Gogh did and create the same sort of thing. Mm. And then, oh wow, what yeah. a genius. Well, you're not a genius yeah. because you ain't created it. When when uh, I was with Toby, he was doing some, uh, some, some work on the Mic Masters uh, okay, yeah, artwork. Yeah, yeah. And um, funny enough, that actual Mic Mic Masters, you know the microphone. Yeah, that yeah. was that's AI. That was designed in AI. Wow. Well, so and it looks good. I think I said it's sick. you and yeah, you. It looks look sick, sick. Yeah, but it does. Seen yeah. that before. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. You know and I mean? that was, you know, we put in like um, microphone. You know, make it. Well, I can't remember what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Things. That's what I'm saying. That's, he that's, said that's, to me, that com- that's worthwhile. Some things are definitely beneficial. Yeah. But yeah, then yeah. There's other well, he said to me, "This is." He goes, "I'm going to start needing to look for something else to do." Because people are just going to start well, making their own artwork. Well, I, I again, we United just st- mm-hmm. we stand. I just said to him, "Look, I made that," and he went, "That's brilliant." Oh, so you made that? I made that. Oh wow! Yeah, okay. and he went, "That's brilliant." And so I, before AI, you couldn't have done that. No, wow. you're crazy. No, you'd way. have had to give a man fifty, sixty pounds to exactly. do the front cover. So yeah, that yeah, saved yeah. us money, and that's a cheap price. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, that is no, a cheap price, yeah, and yeah, you know, yeah, only yeah, because yeah. we've been working with these guys for years. Mm-hmm. That, that's mm-hmm. why. Otherwise, it's like three hundred pound, and yeah, yeah, and you know, so so the thing is, as well, time exactly. Yeah, it is. It is. I understand what you're saying because I want to talk about the DJ Fresh thing. Mm. So I went and had a look because I every time I see something about AI, I, I go and have a look. So I thought, let me have a quick look. And that website where he was talking about the music thing, um, I actually tried to go on there to do something mm. and I, I couldn't get in. So I don't know if it's something that's coming. Okay, yeah, yeah, but, yeah. Um, but it's definitely, you know, they showed, you know, you could listen to what AI made this. But some mm. of it was rubbish, bro. Mm-mm-mm. Like, don't yeah. get it twisted. Some of it was like, yeah, okay. I mean, I'd listen to it and be like, oh, well, yeah. I might listen there to was, that again. There, there was an interesting case in America as well. It got down to a lot of cultural appropriation as well. They basically, they said that AI, who's like, they they, they sort of like um, studied the likes of sort of Takashi 6 9 and you'd call more trap gangster rappers. And then they made their AI rapper version of that. And it was leaning on so many stereotypes. It was using the N word. Right. It was talking about criminal activity. Right. So then it was the case of, right, you all this, this AI has created a stereotypical version yeah. of a young black male. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? That's the danger in it. And that, yeah. that, that, that and they that got signed to a record label. It did. And it got t- it, the, the backlash was so bad. Well, it actually got signed. Yes, yeah, they they must have thought it was a good idea. They they they're thinking like, look, this AI is like if we if we get everything that's been successful with these people that we're studying and like trying to mm. emulate what they do, mm. then we're going to create this AI. We don't have to pay him. We just yeah. pay whoever's designed it and whoever's on the team. Do you know yeah. what I mean? It's not like, mm. you know what I mean? They'll, they'll do hologram shows and they'll do yeah. me- and, they'll, and they'll do all this VR shows so you'll go and watch this guy in VR yeah. so you don't even need to have a venue is it, uh, but I mean, they're just yeah. thinking money That's money yeah, money yeah. Yeah. but the yeah. backlash yeah. Yeah. In, in terms of the cultural appropriation and, and, and the stereotypical things they were doing yeah they got killed for it. They had to say, wow. we apologise, yeah. we would not put anything out by this artist again, so it can get dangerous. And they even called it an artist. It had a, it had a name, man. I, I mean, I can't look it up now, but yeah. Sem- Semtex made a big thing about it on his, on his post. Does it come yeah. under the... Cause- What's the thing where you put on the goggles and you're you're in a virtual? That's, that's, that's like VR, VR or the yeah, Meta. VR. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I was I was reading about that as well. That's mad interesting. Like you done a he done a VR video. Yeah, years a while ago, ago man. Like, virtual you, insanity, and I was yeah. like, you know, I'm like, bro, I've done a whole thing about the dangers of virtual reality yeah. whilst doing a VR video. Yeah, yeah. called it virtual insanity. A little yeah. play on the Jamiroquai choir tune. Yeah. That, do you well, know people what I mean? People pay big money to like have a house next to Stoop Doggy that's Dog right. and all that. Innit? That's right. About that before. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean that's mad. Like so in the Meta, you live next to Snoop and you pay. X amount of money to, yeah. to do it and I, people think it's crazy but you've got to think about it back in the day people used to do that with sims and things like that yeah, yeah, they'd pay yeah. dough or like my little boy with he, he's done well at school he, he wants like a starter pack on his little game he plays do you know yeah, what I mean he's yeah. just building houses and stuff but the, boy, the, is that, is the that Paw that? Patrol ones are nearly a tenner <laughs> <laughs> get back on Thomas son <laughs> Thomas is only 89p yeah I yeah, get it I pay get my it. tax bill you know what I mean it's <laughs> the way of the new world though isn't and it? you can't even run that through it's like <laughs> yeah man I had to do this uh, Paw Patrol thing <laughs> 
<laughs> you get me. But I sort of, that generation of growing up with like literally buying gold rings to get further in a game yeah. and they're just used to it. So yeah. for them, as they grow, I guess, if they want to live next door to their favourite footballer yeah, or yeah. Snoop or whatever we're saying, for them, it's not such a stretch. For us, it's just stupid. I heard yeah. a rumour, now don't quote me, but I heard a rumour to live next to me is about <laughs> 17,000 credits. Well, what, in real life? In, no. <laughs> <laughs> Fantasy's rich, man, you know what I mean? <laughs> West London, boy. You have a few pennies to live in West. Uh, listen, mate, when you're born there, you don't. <laughs> you're lucky, you're just there, uh, yeah. But anyway... Oh, um, interesting, man. Yeah, I mean, look, you know, this is this is definitely something that I think will carry on and on and yeah. as the time goes on. I think we're going to revisit this one. Yeah, as as it develops, I think we need to revisit yeah, it and look it at how people use it. Technology just goes so far before you know it yeah. they're, they're, like you said that website is just maybe it's, it's out there or it ain't yeah. but mm. I'm sure by this time next year it'll yeah. be like up and running yeah. and shit will be going you know more yeah. more up front do you know what I mean and just yeah. more up to date with everything do you know what I'm saying I, I agree man and the thing is as a it's like as a consumer you'd love it innit mm. you'd be like this is amazing you might yeah. not use it all the time whatever yeah. but you, if, you know if you want to create like a AI art picture of yourself just yeah. as a total normal guy yeah. like not, nothing to do with the art industry or creative or anything you're going to think it's amazing the same way as people think Spotify, I pay ten pound a month mm. and I get all them tunes. Yeah. Now the yeah. ramifications is we don't get paid hardly anything yeah, off those yeah, streams. Yeah. But if you're a consumer, yeah, you used to have right. to go and spend ten pound on one CD. Yeah. Or yeah. you'd have to, even in the iTunes area, you'd have to spend eight ninety nine on your full album. Yeah. Now ten pound a month, mm. you just access yeah. to well, everything U you want. Uber. So as a consumer, lovely, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Like Uber and Bolt and all them things. There. I mean, look back in the day, you'd be sitting there ordering a taxi. When is it waiting coming? for? How long? Now yeah. you just look on your phone. I love oh, yeah, Uber. Man. The corner. Yeah. It's so efficient. I, I love mean, Uber. Yeah. I can't they hit that bang would, on Would Uber go into the AI thing though? I don't know if it's AI, but it's technology. Technology. That's what I mean. The technology just. Uh, it just keeps, you know what I mean? And like before, like I said, you'd be sitting there, you, you don't know when the cab's coming, they, you phone up, where's the cab? Yeah. And no, it's just like, oh yeah, about yeah, my cab's three minutes. minutes. <laughs> That's what I mean, but you, you go back there, it's like... Know, uh, someone said to me, it, it's actually come out quite a few times, the guy who actually edits our pod, Sam, big up Sam, he does an amazing job. Um, he actually said to me, uh, we were talking about the old rave days, I think one of our... Oh yeah, actually, you know the pod we'd done about... Um, and the 60s the rebellious the seven, music, the rebellious yeah, music yeah, yeah. yeah he actually said uh, he, he absolutely loved that pod because there you know he was saying to me I, I really wish I was he was born in 92 and he said I really wish I was around that era being being able to go to them raves and yeah. that and, oh, right, and yeah, um, yeah. you know like uh, Michael said to me before we're so lucky to have gone through that um, to be able to have gone through that whole sort of uh, the way things have moved on yeah. and it is quite mad for the kids now they'll never be able to really experience them kind of mm. things that were you're totally right but I think with the kids like now they're going to be romantic about this period yeah, when yeah, they have yeah. their kids they're going to go cool when we used to go on TikTok and see yeah. a headache drop yeah, and then yeah. we go to the rave yeah, and hear the yeah, same yeah. drop amazing you know what yeah, I mean because yeah. they're growing up in that time I'm not going to yeah. use that voice but yeah. you know because I mean? <laughs> it's going to be it's going to be special in their time yeah, isn't it yeah. Yeah. it's like you know like you, all the music you it's when you're the you're youngest and you're growing up with all this music and it's all fresh that's the music you most like listen to well, and it takes you back to that exactly. time I've always said that you know if you are, if you ask when what's your favourite era of music mine would be uh, uh, let Electro was my favourite all-time era, but my favourite mm. in the dance music world would be the 88, 89, because that's when I found it. Yeah. And it was all like, oh my God, what's yeah. going on here? So new, isn't it? They yeah. can't picture that time. They would never be able to imagine what... Nah. Like when I say to people back in the day, like... You used to get your itinerary and they used to get like thick paper like that, bro. Yeah. Like no joke, they used to print it out and they would like it, before even maps maps was about but we never used to use <laughs> maps we just used like yeah go up to the roundabout do you remember the, the left, books the yeah, books. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> big books and then but, but like we used to get our itinerary printed out every week and it would yeah. just be thick like that and we'd be reading it like yeah. oh yeah go up here do a left yeah. and I'd have to go to like Cardiff to like Ipswich in the yeah. middle of the night how do we get there yeah. there's no there's no sat nav no there wasn't like, 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 you, had, you had your mate in the passenger yeah, seat yeah, there, I, I've yeah. done it loads of times being on road like being in the middle of the night like how are we going to get to this place Where where is this place like I'm in the middle of nowhere there's no, 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 warning, no warning and that adds a massive stress yeah. onto the night yeah, 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 like yeah, now yeah, you just yeah. put it in kick back yeah, yeah. I mean well, AA, well, AA, I AA route planner was like yeah. the thing before yeah. the, the yeah. certain yeah. I remember that yeah, me yeah. and Urban yeah. used to yeah, use yeah, that a lot yeah. I can't yeah. I'll tell you what I can't wait for I can't wait till they proper put cars where you just literally type the postcode yeah, it's in. Happening. Oh. It's happening. I know it's happening, but I, I can't don't wait trust till it's it, a man. big... No, man, I'll just sit back and just TikTok. Nah. Yeah. I'll be TikToking the I don't trust the whole it, way I mean, I watched a program about it, this futuristic program or whatever. It was just on telly. I was just flicking and I see it and 
it was about cars, the same sort of thing. And it was like the reason why it was holding them back at the moment is mm. the people on the side of the road. Right. That's the only thing they can't get. The cars ah, can yeah. drive, they can program. It's yeah. like an Uber. You just yeah. u- order, imagine ordering an Uber and no driver don't come. Just yeah. like, oh, but, just but if up. someone runs out in the road, that's, they don't know how to deal with it's that. Unpredic- yeah. It's yeah. unpredictable. So like yeah. even an animal, yeah. a dog running across the road, yeah. they, they can't get that bit yet. Yeah. But I've, everything I have now, like the car, to the location, it's pretty much what's going on now with electric cars. Um, I was a couple blogs online and I was, I was I was just like going through it as well. And then the cars are just like, it's mad, bruv, yeah. the way that the technology is now. Do you know crazy, what I mean? It's man. just crazy. Like you could just program your your car or whatever and just be like, yeah, pick me up here. And it's like, <laughs> you can that, imagine come that. On, like, like, how sick would that be? You know what I mean? That's, like, that's, I mean, that's yeah, some yeah, Batman thing, isn't it? Yeah, man, that's what I'm talking <laughs> like, about. Especially like, if man ain't driving as well yeah. and shit like that. So it'd be like, yeah, like obviously, like even I drive, but I'll get drivers and shit yeah, because... Yeah. Yeah. Doing the both is so it's, much, it's, and it, it would me, take so tiring. much, and that would that, I can see that happening. I don't know if in our lifetime, but I, definitely like it's. We're gonna, gonna see some crazy stuff, yeah, man. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here for it, man. We should well, definitely revisit. You know this what in would be even better? Let's take it one bit further before we wrap this one up. Yeah, you can actually get the car pull up, and then it just goes, just goes up, yeah, <laughs> flies over yeah, the houses, oh, bro, flies by the crow. Bro, you're talking about <laughs> where we're going. We don't need roads. <laughs> Back to the future, boy. Yeah, you mean Emmett Brown and them, man. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just That's crazy it. to think about flying cars and shit like that. Bro, it was in Back to the Future. Pretty much everything Wait, from Back to the Future started to happen. Isn't it mad how films that were back then, the Minority Report and all these things mm. are all... Like, you know, when yeah. back then you were just sort of watching I, robot, I, robot. All of this yeah. stuff, how yeah. it's actually coming to, like, fruitation in a way. Mm. Yeah, hoverboards, do they exist or not? <laughs> Oh, so what, no, but that'd be a good. Well, I mean, they kind of tried to do them with yeah. the what were them boards? Their um, yeah. Skibs had one. Do you remember? Oh, was you're talking about it. the uh, oh man, segways. Yeah, the yeah, segways. Yeah, 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 that was similar. I mean, I, I explained it before. I was in a restaurant, and then this thing just come, and then it brought us our drinks over. Oh yes, you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The bowling alley, and I, I went there again the other day, and I, was, I see the same thing. I was, it just looks weird, bro. Didn't like, you turn around and say, "Oh, is your mate here?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I preferred the way he spoke. Yeah, yeah. It's just like it's <laughs> he had more manners. <laughs> it's mad, mate. Like, Wicked. do you have to tip the robots? Yeah, no. <laughs> I I was tip no, you know what? You tip them like this. You go. <laughs> <laughs> no, listen, I was just like, like, I who, who gets the money? <laughs> Team just went like, right, just get any come, put your drink. And I was just like, raw. Look at that. And I don't know if someone's controlling it or if it's just fucking. You know what I mean? It's just coming or they're programming it to come to the table. How they See, do it? But that's the it different was... type of bowling alleys we go. Where I go, <laughs> someone comes up with teeth missing and they go, "Oi, did you order this burger?" And I go, "Yeah, that's me, mate." And they go. <laughs> What, that in West? Yeah. Next to the Lamb Flag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, <laughs> I thought we'd get through one episode about yeah. the Lamb and Flag. Oh, mate, I was in there the other day dancing to Come On Eileen, man. It was amazing. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Celebrating the uh, Neil Neil for yeah. them. Lovely, lovely result. All <laughs> oh, right. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, definitely it, wrap it up. <laughs> <laughs> People, we're going to wrap this one up. Obviously, like, share. Make sure you comment as well. We read all the comments, man. Do you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we love you guys. Keep it moving. See you soon. Peace. 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 Beats and bars, fresh, fresh, fresh. Don't know what heavy. The best of the best of the best. So ask awesome them if they're ready. Yes, yes, yes. S A S A S A S S S. Beats and bars, fresh, fresh, fresh. Don't know what heavy. The best of the best of the best. So ask awesome them if they're ready. Yes, yes, yes.